one hand against the other. Shabay Prema! Hey, you guys better laugh. I plucked my monobrow for this shit. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so, as you can probably tell, I'm originally from Sydney. Uh, you can get a good tan up in Sydney. Uh, I know this is the red room we're in tonight, but uh, I'm going to turn this into the brown room. So, sorry, white people. Uh, <laughs> but my name's Chave, that's spelled S-H-I-V-E. And uh, it's a difficult one to remember, but I always say uh, you can't spell Chave without H-I-V. <laughs> Of that, I am positive. <laughs> well, my name hasn't always been Chave. I actually had to change it while I was working at a call center. Uh, there was a lot of Indian people working at this call center. And, uh, you know, I'm not going to say this stereotype is true, but, uh, well, it's fucking true. <laughs> I came in on the first day and the boss, he's showing me the ropes and he says, Chave, I want to introduce you to Rajesh. <laughs> now... When Rajesh makes a call, he goes by the name of Roger. <laughs> when you make a call, what's your name going to be? Uh, Sean? Yeah, Sean. That's a good, respectable white people name. So when I make a call, it'll go something like this. Hi, this is Sean from Waste Your Time. How's your day going today? Wait, why don't you stop taking our fucking jobs, you curry muncher? Wait, how do you know I'm Indian? Mate, I can hear you munching on curry. <laughs> Shit, yeah, I've got to stop doing that. <laughs> but I was, uh, I was raised a Hindu. Uh, Hindus traditionally, they don't eat meat. They're vegetarian. Uh, but me personally, I eat everything. Fish, meat, ass. <laughs> <laughs> got to eat the booty like grocery. Um... I uh, know when you look at me, you probably think, this guy is a fucking stud. Um, but I've actually been going through a bit of a dry spell lately. Um, yeah, I haven't smashed in months. <laughs> and my roommates are asking me, Chave, you haven't bought any girls home. Are you gay? I said, no. Just a fucking loser. <laughs> a lot of people have lucky numbers. My lucky number is seven. Because I've gotten lucky seven times <laughs> with one girl. One lucky girl. But who's counting, right? Uh, the other day I went to the dentist, uh, got my cavities filled. Uh, but uh, couldn't walk for three days after. Yeah. Anyway, next week I'm going back for a root canal. <laughs> um, it's, it's a little bit embarrassing, actually, but... Um, Yesterday, at the Anzac Day service, I farted. Yeah. I mean, don't worry, it wasn't loud. Just a moment of silence. But deadly. Uh, I was walking past this gelato shop, um, and they were doing breast milk ice cream. And I went in to get a cone, but uh, it only came in jugs. This is a coffee city. We love our coffee here. A lot of people have their favorite coffee. Uh, me, personally, I like my coffee how I like my women. Skinny, flat, white. <laughs> uh, I was walking down the street the other day and this homeless person asked me for some change. I said, like, sorry, mate, I, I don't have anything on me. And he said, you're an Indian. You don't give money. I said, yeah, you're right. Yeah, we don't do that. That's not something we do. Um, but apart from being a in, uh, full-time Indian, I'm also a part-time student. Uh, I study journalism. Uh, I chose journalism because it's a dying industry. And I hate myself. Uh, I recently finished an internship at uh, Channel 7. Yeah, it's pretty impressive. You can applaud that if you want. Yeah. But uh, I've been working on my, my news, my reporter voice, um, and I was just wondering if, if you guys would like to hear it. Yeah? Okay. There has been another mass killing at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Activists are wondering just how many more young wizards and witches have to die before we get stricter wand control laws. But luckily, the Minister for Magic say, offers his thoughts and prayers. 
And in other news, Melburnians love their coffee. A new study shows that there are actually more baristas in the city than there are people. <laughs> the rise in the number of baristas has been linked to African gangs. <laughs> this is Sean Premer reporting for Fake News. That's fine, passing the baton. Lovely. Chevet Prima. I'm giving another clap. 